stuff they do, so um, I don't have that. Yeah, you're a Muslim, I presume, because you're white. It's your wife, I assume it's your wife anyway. No, you're not your wife. Daughter, it's daughter, sorry, excuse me. Daughter, yeah. So you're a Muslim, yeah. Okay. Why are you Muslim? Why? Yes. I mean, what? I believe in Allah. And Pardon? I believe, believe in Allah, in Allah yeah. I mean, were you born Muslim or did you become Muslim? I became Muslim when okay. I was teenagers. Yeah. So why, why did you choose Islam? Rather Sorry, than why Islam? Why did you choose Islam rather than, say, uh, Christianity or the, the Quran, another religion? The Quran has been preserved. A child in Africa, a child in France, they memorize it. Yes. And it's if, if, if you throw all the books in the ocean, they could make a Quran within a day. The Bible, they couldn't do it. The, the, the Hindu books, they couldn't do it. But so, yeah, people do know? memorize the Quran or yeah. parts of the Quran or the whole of Quran, yeah. don't they? Yeah. The Bible is about 10 times the length of the Quran, so it's more difficult to memorize yeah, the whole lot, obviously. Allah said in the Quran, um, it, it's a, it's a but, book uh, preserved. Yeah. And that's a, that's a miracle of it. Yeah, I mean the Quran is not perfectly preserved, but it is. Yeah, it is. No, it's not actually it perfectly preserved. It is. No, it's preserved. In in two thousand years time, yeah. I would like to think a little yes. child could recite it word yeah. for word again. Are you Sunni Muslim? Sorry. Are you Sunni Muslim? Uh, yeah. Yes, but that's, okay. there's only one Islam. People yeah. chose yeah. different. No, no, what I mean was, would you accept the Sunni hadith, like you know, Sahih Bukhari or Sahih Muslim, and so on? Yeah, you have to. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, that's the only reason why I asked you that. Yeah, you have to. Because yeah, in those in those uh, Sahih hadith, it does talk about parts of the Quran which have been lost or have been changed in no, various that's ways. That's incorrect. No, you're wrong. You're completely wrong. I'm not wrong, actually. I, I can show you. The, the, Passages in the in the hadith which say we talk uh, about. I'm not, a, I'm not a hadith scholar, so I I will just will agree to disagree. Uh, I will find for you some. I need my specs, so otherwise I can't see my screen. <laughs> I don't know whether you have the difficulty. <laughs> yeah. So I show you. Right, Quran variants. Okay. So we know that when Muhammad um, recited the Quran, there were seven different ways of reciting it. Yeah, yeah? that's correct. Yeah. Seven aruf. Okay. And we we also know that um, the people that he said you are to learn the Quran from these people like um, Ibn Masud, Salim, Abu Hadaifa. Uh, Obai, Amuad. Um, so these are these are people whom uh, whom Muhammad said to learn the Quran from. Yeah. Okay. But what we do know is that those people didn't have quite the same Quran as Uthman produced. The Quran that we are using is a Quran which came from Uthman. Yeah. Yeah. But they had slightly different Qurans. Even Masud. Even Masud's yeah, Quran the, the, had the, 111. The ones that made the mistakes were the ones that were rejected. Okay. Because when Prophet Muhammad died, so Allah Salam, he, he, he recited himself and yes. he had the people listen to him and then it was finalized. Uh, but then Uthman had to come along later and produce the Quran that we now have, yeah? Because he, but Uthman in, in, was... In, uh, while I'm not an expert, I, I, yeah. that was probably in the written form. But verbally, it was, it was finalized. Yeah, when we read in Sahih Bukhari, we're told about the history of the Quran, yeah? Uh, Sahih Bukhari says that at the time of the Battle of Yamama, people who knew the Quran, who'd memorized the Quran from Muhammad, were dying in the battle. And Uthman, uh, Abu Bakr was worried that the Quran, or a large part of the Quran, might be lost. Therefore, he ordered that the Quran be collected. And Abu Bakr um, chose Said ibn Tabet, yeah, Said ibn Tabet, to um, collect together the Quran for him. That Quran was then kept until the time of Uthman. Then Uthman um, wanted to revise the Quran which had been collected under Abu Bakr by Said ibn Tabet, and he so he ordered Said ibn Tabet 
and a, and a number of people. Would be the wrong to... word. It would be confirmed. Okay, call it confirm if you like. Need to be call it... Yeah. Okay, call it confirm if you like. But anyway, then there was like a second edition under Uthman, and then he, Uthman decided that um, his the the copy which he had produced or that I had been tabbed to produce for him should be distributed throughout the Islamic world and the other versions of the Quran should be destroyed. So those of Yeah, yeah, yeah. I agree with that, yeah. I agree yeah. With that. So so those other reciters of the Quran which um which which Muhammad had uh, authorized to learn the Quran from, they were um, they were not happy with the Quran which uh, which Uthman had produced. So you're still using the wrong terminology. They didn't produce the Quran. Okay, which he recorded. recorded Will it be, yes. be better? Okay, recorded. Yeah. So, so Ubay says uh, Ubay was well. Umar said Ubay was the best of us in the recitations of the Quran. Yeah, we leave some of what he recites. Ubay says I've taken it from the mouth of Allah's apostle and will not leave it for anything whatsoever. I'll, yeah. I'll, I'll have to research it to be honest. Yeah. But so you are aware some hadith are weak. Okay, so you can buy that on you. There's a chain of hadith. Well, this is a Sahih, Sahih hadith. Yeah, okay. Some of, are, some of them can still be weak. Okay, so this is Sahih Bukhari, five thousand and five, or from Abi Dawood. Uh, and in other places as well, it's recorded that Ubay was not happy with Uthman's I'll, Quran. I'll, I'll check that out when I get back. Okay. Also, um, also we find that um, Ibn Masud was not happy either. So in this Sahih Hadith, Jami al Timidi, uh, Volume 5, Book 44, Hadith number 3104, um, Abdullah. Ibn Masud disliked Zayd bin Tabit copy of the Musahif and he said, O oh, you Muslim people, avoid copying the Musah and the recitation of this man. Keep the Musahif which are with you and conceal them. And you can also find that in Sahih Muslim and other places, okay. yeah? Well, I'm, I'm going to go around, yeah? yeah. Give me your time. Okay. But parts of the Quran have been removed by that time. What we find in the Hadith is that parts of the Quran have been lost. Okay. So, so here we find at least two surahs have gone missing from the Quran in yeah, Sahih that, that, Muslim. That, that's still incorrect, but don't worry. Anyway, thank you. But the hadith here. do talk about the parts of the Quran which have been lost and the parts which have changed. You're welcome.